the U.S. Cellular Coliseum will be packed with Dirk Spetley fans for the Jägermeister Country Tour. But before the concert, the Pepsi Ice Center was the hot spot for a little bit of hockey. It's nice. It's a chance to step away from a lot. Doing interviews and all that stuff, and just and a chance to play hockey and have fun, and go out there and skate and get it all out of my system. Before the teams get on the ice, let's check in with Kevin and JD from B104 to see what this is all about. Prepare to get killed. There's probably Thunder players out there. How did this happen, JD? Uh, I let the word out to Jim Riggs, the uh, general manager, and I, I just was going to have him come out and watch, and all of a sudden I see them in their stuff, and, and they're wanting to play. Man, this is kind of. It's kind of freaky, a little, little nerve-wracking. But Dirk Bentley says time on the ice before a big concert gives him a sense of relief. He says he took the ice for the first time 10 years ago. Says the game applies to his skills on the stage as well. You know, we got six guys on the uh, on the ice, that being on the, uh, you know, on the uh, stage. And uh, yeah, we kind of approach it the same way. We want to go out there and get a win and fight hard and play good and hopefully walk away with the crowd and everyone feeling like they had a great show. Other than the country star, Bloomington police and firefighters took the ice with some Prairie Thunder players, J.D. and Kevin. Though it was all for fun, Kevin and J.D. made sure they had on the right gear. Hopefully I won't get hurt. That's what we're hoping for. So one thing about that, we got Dirk's cell phone number, so that'll come in handy way tonight. Reporting in Bloomington with Paul Morello, I'm Michelle Mantel. Oh, little close dancing, what was I thinking? Hey, but that crossed my mind a little too late.